chocolate inspired Valentine's Day drinks. Mm, that sounds delicious. Joining us now, mixologist Jessica Borgoyne from Sin City in Philadelphia. Good morning, Jessica. Good morning, Monica. How are you? Oh, I'm doing great. Thank you so much for sending all this stuff so that we can talk to people about the fun things you can do with chocolate and uh, drinks. Jessica, there's something about it adding uh, romance to the day. First, tell us what's in a chocolatini. In this chocolatini, we have equal parts vodka and uh, dairy cream. You can do a dairy substitute if you'd like, a soy milk, cashew milk, mm -hmm. or lactose. There's also an ounce of creme de cacao. That can be a more liquid version, or you can get a little creamier so that you can have like a viscous martini, and you can get like a Godiva chocolate or a chocolate liqueur, which is really fun. Uh, mm. We just drizzle um, chocolate syrup and shake up the martini, pour it in, garnish with some um, orange slice, and... Right, so Jessica, what's, what's uh, with the orange slice? Because you know, I wouldn't necessarily think, you know, I think of that as more of like a, like a, a Belgian beer a garnish. Right. Yeah, actually, orange actually pairs really well with chocolate. Um, I mean, mm -hmm. you get snacks, fruit, things. Ooh, I like this. I like this drizzle of chocolate around the rim. That's so fun. Mm, enjoying that. Okay, let's head uh, to this uh, cocoa old fashioned. Yes, that's right. Yeah, the cocoa old fashioned. So old fashioned is uh, pretty much the OG. Of uh, you have your bourbon or your whiskey, and you're going to mix it with, like, a sweetener, simple syrup, or um, sugar. And you have your orange slice. In this case, uh, we put some chocolate bitters into it. Mm -hmm. You can also infuse your brandy, I mean, your bourbon or whiskey, with cocoa, so it can have even more chocolate in it if you'd like. And top it off with orange slice and brandy cherries. Okay, how would you infuse that then? Would you let it sit out for, you know, how long and, and how do you do that? Into your brandy and have it sit for a while, then you can strain it out and use it at home. Okay, all right, great. Okay, so uh, Jessica, you're going to kind of lead me through making this fun drink. What are we making today? So today we're going to do the Melting Hearts red wine and hot chocolate. Okay. Ah, so put your um, hot chocolate and milk mix. You can also do a substitute, of course. And I just kind of put it in there. A little okay. less than glass. Nice and warmed. And then you can put in your four ounces of red wine. Red wine of your choice. I love red wine, so this is exciting. I, I did not know you should be mixing wine and milk, but okay. <laughs> it does sound a little crazy. I'm a little nervous. A little <laughs> Don't be nervous, it's great. Okay. Give it a little stir, and then this is the fun part. Go so a little bit crazy. We can do some whipped topping. Wow. And, yes. Because what's hot cocoa without marshmallows? Nothing. It is nothing. Do some sprinkles with oh. a little red Valentine's Day. Ooh. Oh. oh, red sprinkles. <laughs> Jessica, this is so nice of you to send us all this stuff. I love it. Look at this sprinkle. And then uh, use your straw. Take a sip and tell me what you think. Um, this is so romantic. This would be like a fun thing just to do, you know, with, with, with your, your, your love and making drinks, kind of sprinkling on things. Okay, here we go. Cheers, Jessica. I think this, this straw is my favorite. Wonderful. Mmm. That'll warm you right, right up, Jessica. Exactly. Red wine and hot chocolate. Who knew? Who knew? This is okay. Uh, I also really like. I like the I like the marshmallows and and the um, the Cool Whip. Thank Thanks. you so much. Where can people go for more info? Um, you guys can go for more info online. Is it posted online so you can see all yep. the ingredients? We'll have all, all of this on phl17.com and uh, Sin City. Great place yeah. to go to. All right. Thank you so much, Jessica. Thank you. All right. Still ahead.